What's up everybody? Welcome to another Apex Academy video. Today's going to be a real easy, simple video to kind of go through. We're going to be showing how to set up upsells for your one product store. You guys know I've been talking about one product stores for a little while. I'm starting to get some questions. How do I set, you know, I'm getting questions from different people how to do this, how to do that. So today's uh, video is going to be an upsell video, show you guys how to do upsells for your one product store. I'm going to be also talking about why it's important to set up upsells. So let's just go into the one product store. By the way, I am using the Themato uh, one product store theme. Uh, you guys can access it by going to oneproducttheme.themato.com. Uh, you know, you could take a look at their demos. You can order the buy now button. The theme is currently $79. And also they have a discount code. So if I click on this little button, they have like a little... Uh, discount code that you guys can go ahead and take a look at it says here use code summer so you guys could check it out use the discount code get yourself a discount when you use the theme because uh, I know some people are gonna ask me what theme am I using so on and so forth so let's go ahead and jump into the upsell so the reason why you want to have upsells for your theme kind of like this a customer is gonna show up and and you're gonna do majority of the marketing for one specific product does that make sense so uh, whatever that one product is a good example of this let's just head over here let's open this up in a new tab so we can just uh, kind of see the newsletter feature and all that kind of stuff so let's go to oneproducttheme.com so I can kind of explain what the purpose of this is go over here and click view demo you copy and paste the password hit view demo and paste the password in and enter I want to show you guys the purpose when you're doing marketing, you're doing marketing on the main product, right? Which in this case, this is the main product, right? This is their demo. This is the motto's one product theme demo, okay? Blendjet, et cetera. You go over here, you pick your product, whatever color you want. Let's just say you want the blue variation. You hit add to bag. Well, what happens is, is you want to boost the average order value. This is also known as the AOV, okay? And when people talk about AOV, you know that stands for average order value. Let's go ahead and get rid of this real quick. All right, so people add the product to their cart. Well, guess what? They might not necessarily be thinking about extra bonuses to pay for, but you get this little upsell. You know, Amazon does the same thing. It says you may also like these products and it shows like a bunch of products and they can click add to cart. And guess what? They get more upsells. Now, why does upsells matter and how do they help? Once again, they increase average order value, but more importantly, with this specific theme, notice here it says free shipping for any orders over X amount. You can change this number, by the way. Um, and then here it shows the amount left for you to spend to get free shipping. So the more products I add or the more products I add to my cart, aka upsells, the better chance I have to get free shipping and the increase I will get. Well, from a consumer standpoint, I'll have a higher chance to get free shipping. But from a seller standpoint or a business owner standpoint, the more money you're going to make. Right. So it's, the concept is very simple. Every business uses this or every business that's making money uses this. So let's go ahead and jump right in here. All right. So um, how to set it up. OK. Now, there's two ways to set this up. Whenever you hit the add to cart button or add to bag, you want to have the upsells here and you want to have the upsells also when people are scrolling down, you want to have it somewhere on your website. So let's go ahead and hit here the cust online store and then customize. So let's go to online store themes and then hit the customize button. And very simply put, the first one we're going to focus on is the product slider upsell. So wait for this to load. Give it like about five more seconds, right? Five, four, three, two, one. Should uh, kind of load by now. All right. So go over here, scroll down, and hit the, uh, where is it here? It is the product slider. So if we scroll down, scroll down, it's right under the lookbook. So find the lookbook for us. I mean, for you, it might be different, but it's this button right here, the motto product slider, and just literally go over here to the right and pick the collection that you want. In my case, I called it the upsell collection. You could call it what you want. Uh, you could change this title. It doesn't have to, you know, be called upsell or it could be called uh, our bonuses or, you know, you know, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Hit save uh, and then wait for it to reload. There'll be this green bar right here on the top. And it'll reload, and that's kind of how it looks like, right? So you can also set up the arrow keys and, you know, show navigation, show scroll bar, limit the amount of products that are shown, all that kind of cosmetic stuff, right? Obvious stuff. Now, for the products to 
to pop up here when you add a product to the cart and you have these you just have to simply go to every product that you have okay and you want to tag the product so the product has to be tagged right here you navigate to the product page you go to the tag section and you need to call it upsell right if you do not call it upsell it is not going to work um, I read this information in the uh, Thamato documentation website um, but you know, I'm just literally saving you guys time. Instead of you guys sitting there reading through the documentation, you could do it this way. Type in upsell. You cannot type in, you know, summer clothing, all this kind. I mean, you could add in extra tags if you want to, but it has to be called upsell so that the system knows these are the products that you want to create as upsell so that when somebody adds the product to the cart, right? There's the upsell. So for example, let's say I change my mind and I don't want this product to be in the upsell section. It's very simple. I just, so if I remove this little tag that says upsell here, which I just did, it won't show up here. Okay. Does that make sense? So whichever product you want to show up in the upsell, uh, just simply give it the little upsell tag and that's it. All right. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions on the theme, please let me know. We're going to be doing a lot more tutorials, a lot more guides, things like that. So, uh, put put your put you know your requests in the comments down below. I'll talk to you guys later. All right, peace out. Bye.